What if you held your breath and just refused to stop? What really happens in your body? Let's break it down. Okay, the first 30 seconds, you're fine. You're just running on all the oxygen you already had in your blood, no big deal. But then, the panic starts, and here's the crazy secret. You're not panicking from a lack of oxygen. You're panicking because of the buildup of CO2. See, that CO2 mixes with your water and makes your blood slightly acidic. And your brain hates this. It's a huge red flag. So your brain hits the panic button, that jump you feel in your chest. That's your diaphragm, your main breathing muscle spasming. It's your brain screaming, I am not kidding, breathe now. But what if you're stubborn? You keep holding. Do you die? No, your brain has one last failsafe. Your automatic brain, the brainstem, sees the danger and just shuts you down. You completely pass out. And the instant you're unconscious, your automatic brain takes over. You take a huge gasp of air and you're fine. So yeah, you literally can't do it. Your body is too smart. So what emoji is that panic feeling? Drop it.